people treat Jews like they're from another planet. Like one time I was dating a woman from Wisconsin. She brought me back to her family for Christmas. And the whole time her mom was like, Matt, can you eat ham? <laughs> Everything here is ham. <laughs> I was like, why are you acting like I'm the freak? You people are obsessed with ham. Do I eat ham? Honey, I don't even believe in God. By the time you see how much ham I can eat, you won't believe in God either. You'll be like, if Jesus loved me, how could he create this bearded ham vacuum? In college, I wasn't the homecoming king. I was the hamcoming king. I didn't blaze, I glazed. My favorite singer isn't Sammy Davis Jr. It's Frank Sinatra. The man is a legend. It was fun spending Christmas with my ex. My ex's parents got me a couple of gifts. They got me a bottle of whiskey and a pair of black leather gloves. I was like, thank you, but I don't feel comfortable murdering your daughter. And besides, I'm still tired from murdering your Messiah. Guys, that was a joke. The Jews didn't kill Jesus. We don't do manual labor. We hired Mexicans to do it. The Jews hate manual labor so much that one of us was a carpenter, and that's the one we crucified. People ask me why Jewish guys are so socially awkward, and I can only speak from my own experience, but the first party I ever went to, a strange man who I'd never seen before cut the tip of my penis off. <laughs> so yeah, I'm kind of weird around new people. <laughs> One time my roommate came home, he's like, Matt, I went to the craziest party. I'm like, no you didn't. <laughs> Did a rabbi steal part of your dick? Because your parents paid him to? While the rest of your family just stood around eating brisket, doing nothing? <laughs> Whatever, I'm proud of my mutilated dick. <laughs> Do you guys know that my penis was in the Guinness Book of World Records? And then I pulled it out when I found a bookmark. <laughs> It's a dick joke, but it makes you think. It's, uh... Not only did they take my foreskin, they didn't even let me keep it. Could have had some fun with that thing, you know what I mean? Could have given it to my cat as a bracelet. Use it around the house, balanced a wobbly table. Could have snuck it into a coworker's Cheerios. 